Hi, Planner Babes. It's Kim here from Memories in Time. Today, I would like to do a flip through of my January Faith Planner. And if you are a follower of mine, you know that in early January, well, the end of December, 1st of January, I set up a transformer planner and one of the planners that I included in the transformer planner was this beautiful rose gold and teal the steadfast love of the Lord never ceases I absolutely love this color love it love it love it just gorgeous all the beautiful rose gold and teals so, what I decided to do is just put one month of my Faith Planner in, my Transformer Planner. So, it's January, and I would like to just share that beautiful divider dashboard. Beauty is God's handwriting. Isn't that gorgeous? Absolutely gorgeous. The colors are so soft and soothing they're beautiful green and lilac and just the little spatters so what i would like to do first is just share with you how i did my january monthly of course my absolute all-time favorite scripture is philippians 4 13 i can do all things through christ who strengthens me so this sticker represented my all-time favorite scripture and then look how perfectly the colors worked with the january monthly i also used these stickers came from the green faith book with the exception of this one and i'll tell you in just a second where that one came from so this sticker came from that faith book this silver always be unborn kind and the cute little hearts came from that sticker book this is just a clear sticker that is um, Hobby Lobby, the Paper Studio brand, and from back three years ago when I first started with Happy Planner, and I had a Faith Planner at that time, I actually had picked up a package of these, and I just love this, and I just felt like this was perfect for January. So, um... I can do all things through him and then it feels like it translates on to say that whoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life and so what I did is for my daily study my daily scripture I just wrote in what book it was from and what verse I read or what verse I was studying that day so, just a real quick flip through. I'm not going to read everything. I will let you know that I did use my midliner highlighters as I was working through here. My washi is just washi that came from either Hobby Lobby or Michaels. And then, again, all of the stickers were stickers that came from the Green Faith Book. And you can see that in some places I did highlight things. When I got to Monday, January 7th through Sunday, January 13th, I started sort of playing around a little bit with the way that I was doing my scripture. Um, you can see this was the week that I probably decided I needed to use the highlighter first and then come back in with my pen because it did bleed a little there, but I'm okay with that. Um, I did play around with just a little bit of the way that I did my words. I was really happy with that. Again, all of the stickers came from the Green Faith book. And I did, let me go back over here. I did not include a prayer list for the first week. I did include a prayer list for the second week. And then for the third week, I did include a prayer list. And I, my prayer list for that week was for my baby sister, her husband, niece, and nephew. Um, the Saturday the 19th was my sister's birthday. And I'm just very blessed that God has allowed me to be the older sister 
of an amazing baby sister with an absolutely incredible brother-in-law and my one and only niece and nephew. So I'm very, very blessed and thankful for them. Again, I played around a little with how I did my writing, my words. Stickers came again from the green sticker book. And then, in this week, I really didn't play around as much with my, my writing, my lettering. I did get a little big there. I did not cover this up, though, because all of my scripture for the week of January 21st through 27th was about finding strength, stepping out in faith and courage and encouragement. Do not be discouraged. And then when I saw this... Don't dig up and doubt what you have planted in faith that resonated in me. And so my note to myself as that week ended was so much of the scripture for, for that week was reminding me to be strong in God's word and his faith and that I cannot fail when I have faith in him and put, you know allow myself to have faith in the strength that he has given me. And then... For last week, I did play a little bit more with my words, my writing last week. Um, my washi, I loved my washi. My washi, really, it didn't, like, this and this did not come together in the same kit. But I loved how the washi all kind of just pulled everything together as I ended January and made a transition into February. And I did have a prayer list for last week as well. For those of you who follow me, you know I had a, a trip to Orlando and my prayer was for safe travels there and back. It was bitter, freezing, frigid, cold here at home in Kentucky while I was gone. And although it was cool while I was in Orlando and very stressful because the last three days of the month, I was really stressing to get my final reports in for work. However, the last night I was there on Thursday night, it was warm enough and there was a little sun and I got to go to City Walk, which is one of my all-time favorite places in Orlando. So I was very, very blessed. Um, I did have a lot of swelling. I have an injury from three years ago. I had a very massive cut to my leg that left a lot of trauma and scar tissue behind and so I did have a lot of swelling so I did pray for swelling of the area in my foot and everything as I traveled and of course for the pilots. And that is my January walk through or flip through in my faith planner. Thank you for joining me and I hope that you have enjoyed this faith planner flip through i hope that you give this video a thumbs up if you happen to use um happy planner faith planner or faith warrior be sure and leave me a comment below and tell me how you use yours is it for daily scripture study do you journal in it how do you use your faith planner um if you like this video please subscribe and hit the notification bell so that as i move into february and put a new month in here you will be able to be notified of that content and any other content I add. Thank you for joining me today and have a great day.